Welcome back to Jeebus Gaming, guys. We just went by the first GameStop and grabbed one bag out of the dumpster. It's not that heavy. I'm hoping we have something since they had absolutely nothing yesterday. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button for awesome dumpster drives every single day. And leave this video a big fat thumbs up. And let's get right into it. all that heavy but last time I set that it ended up being loose disc and here's a blank case already. Do we have a game? No. Just a dummy case. I'll leave it in the bag. We got a bunch of price labels and real, real trash. Ooh, a bag with something in it. Whoa, what kind of case is that? Splatoon for SWI? Anyone know what that is? Let me know in the comments please. I have no idea. I'm going to keep it because I've never seen it. Let's see what else we got in here. Subway cup. Um, trying not to make a mess. As you can see, this is not my normal car. My car's been acting weird, so we left it at home. Let's see. I feel, I feel like I'm gonna have to take some of it out to see in here. All right, I'll throw it all away right after. And we got Sonic Boom, just a box. That's unusual. Usually DS cases are in there. Looks like that might be it for this one. Might be just a trash bag. Yeah, it looks like this one's all trash, but I'm gonna keep that box. It's pretty cool. I'm a Sonic fan, so anyway, I'll see you guys at the next one. Guys, welcome back to the next dumpster, and we got one of these good bags. For you, the guys that don't dumpster dive, these thicker ones usually mean there's better stuff in it. A lot of times they're returns, so let's hope there's something good in here. I got my fingers crossed. Aw, oh, it's just a crappy bag inside of a good bag. They trolled me. Maybe we'll have something. The Wendy's? I see a case already. Uh, Paper Mario. No game. I'll only take the cases if they have the um, cover art and manual and stuff like that. Let's see what we got. Ooh, look at this. A bunch of cases. Let's see what we got. Power Rangers for the 3DS? Just a case. Another Paper Mario for 3DS, just a case. Um, the Hawk for Nintendo Wii case. They're probably going to be all cases. WWE case, Sonic case, Spider-Man case, and some Mickey Mouse. Also a case. That's okay. I'll use them all for my case wall. Let's keep digging. Gotta be something in here. They wouldn't use it back for nothing. Whoa. Legends for the Wii U. Also, just a case. Oh my gosh. Star Wars Battlefront for PS4. <gasps> there we go. Check the condition of it. Oops. Freaking flawless. There we go. Yes. Perfectly good PS4 game already. Second one of the night. That is so awesome. Alright, let's see what else we got in here. Might be it. Oh, it looked like some nice cup once upon a time before it broke. It looks like that could be it. Um, yeah, looks like that's it at that one. We got a freaking PS4 game and a bunch of cases. I'll see you guys at the next one. Welcome back to Jeebus Gaming, guys. We just grabbed one, two bags from GameStop. In a pretty big bag from five below. I didn't want to take the trash home because my dumpster's starting to get full, so decided I'll go through all this at the trunk. Let's go through these little GameStop bags first. Sorry, stupid motorcycle guy in the background, but let's see. Oh, I thought that was a game for sure. It felt really thick. Bunch of envelopes. Um, Gatorade. Baskin Robbins. Man, somebody had a treat here, didn't they? Um, ew, I just touched their spoon. That's pretty gross. Uh, Gatorade, and more useless gift cards. These GameStop bags are pretty light, so I'm really not expecting there to be much of anything in there. But the five below bag is heavy. Ooh, I see a case. Just a 360 case, not broken though, so I'll definitely take it. Maybe there'll be a loose disc in here I can put in there, hopefully. But I already got a PS4 game tonight, so if I don't find any more games, I'm happy. Anytime I find a new gen case, it's just exciting. Even though I don't even own a PS4. Ew. Trail mix is still in there. But. Personally, I think trail mix belongs in the trash can, whether it's new or used or not. Well, 
Nothing in these two GameStop bags, so that's one freaking case and no cover art or anything. Anyway, let's get into this big boy. This bag is freaking heavy. I'm assuming there's a lot in here. Whoa. Man, where do I even start in this thing? Woo. All right, let's see. Some type of broken brush and a ribbon. What are all these? Oh my goodness, hair clips galore. One, two, three, I ripped one, four, five, six, seven, Jeebus, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Why are there so many hair clips? Holy crap, there's like 20 more packs. Look at this 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Oh my goodness. So many locks. We can pick so many locks according to Fallout Logic. Put them all on the side. A brush. Uh, is this broken? Yeah. Ooh, God, that almost cut me. Broken mirror. Did they break all these on purpose? That's not. I mean, it's definitely something I would assume Five Below would do. Are these. Oh, I think these are paddle. Oh, that's a mirror. I almost shot my face. Ah, uh, look, I think they broke these brushes on purpose. That's not good. Another broken mirror. Let's see. That one's good. It looks like they cleared out their like bathroom supply area. There's definitely a lot of broken mirrors. That's a good one right here. These ones are broken. Broken brushes. And they really like destroy brushes. Like, is that are they really gonna go through all that over brushes? Here's a bunch more bobby pins. Oh my god, like imagine finding this in Fallout. If you play Fallout, you know what I'm talking about. That would be like a jackpot right there. Let's see. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Holy crap. There's like another 50 packs of freaking hair clips here. Look at this. I probably have like 200 bobby pins. What the heck am I going to do with 200 bobby pins? And there's not even the majority of them. Look at this. That's a broken mirror, but look at this. There's like, I don't even know what, how many bobby pins you think that is. I'm surprised. The Five Below didn't actually pay somebody to sit there and break all these bobby pins. I actually would not have been surprised. Holy crap. There's a man that's broken. Well, if I ever need a bobby pin anymore in my life, then I'm doing something wrong. More bobby pins. Why are there so many? What did they throw every bobby pin they had in the store out? And... Other than a bunch of broken mirrors, I think that might be it in here. Yeah, it looks like all the rest of the mirrors and brushes are broken. Anyway, I'll see you guys once we get everything home. Welcome back to Jeebus Gaming, guys. We just got home. We didn't have that great of a night, but we still had some pretty cool finds. First off, this is probably 20 plus pounds of freaking bobby pins. Like, I'm not even joking. There's probably 20 pounds or more of bobby pins from five below i'm pretty sure i can list these as a lot on ebay since each pack of those had a three dollar price tag on them there's probably 50 or 60 packs in there so that's definitely some money to be made right there we found a stack of cases that i'll be adding to the case wall one wii u i don't really find them usually a bunch of wii games and a 3ds game a few other things we found in the five below dumpster uh three mirrors the majority of them are all busted but these three are fine, so I'll give them to somebody. Uh, brush here, only a $2 price tag. I just took it mainly because it had Barney colors and it made me think of Barney. When I was like two, Barney was my show. The best find of the night, definitely Star Wars Battlefront for the PlayStation 4. I found quite a few PS4 games, but I actually not found Star Wars Battlefront. And as you can see, it is in absolutely flawless condition. It doesn't even look like it's even been touched, so... That's definitely the best find of the night. Anytime I find a new gen game is definitely awesome. And you want to bet. You see that crack in the case? I'm willing to bet money. They threw this in the trash because that case had a little tiny crack in it. Which is just absolutely ridiculous on GameStop's part. But I'm not going to complain because it means free stuff for me. Anyway, thank you guys for checking out the video. If you did enjoy, make sure you leave it a big fat thumbs up. And if you're not already, hit that subscribe button for awesome dumpster dives every single day. And until next time, peace out.